Hey guys, what's really good? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Diamond. I hope you are doing really well. Welcome back to another vlog. And in this vlog today, listen, there's a new wig in town. There's a new uh, meal in town. And as always, nothing but positivity and good vibes. So I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. Please do not forget to comment, to like, and to subscribe. And if you found this helpful, fun, or whatever, please share to somebody else so that they can enjoy the good vibes as well. Thank you, guys. I'll catch you soon. Mwah. New hair, who this? I don't know why you have a wig bother or whatever. You know, like, give it up. Oh, this one's a baddie. This one's a baddie. Oh, my gosh. Can you believe this hair looks like this and I haven't even seen Slice the lace yet can you guys believe that this is what this hair looks like and i haven't even really i haven't even really done much to it oh my goodness i am here for hair like this okay no this hair is amazing listen it's 5 p.m somewhere do you know what i mean the washing machine is going off as well there's a lot going on it's a busy household but anyways i listened to um kevin samuels and i am a fan of his work Although not all of it, because some things he says is just ridiculous. But overall, I just feel like a lot of the things that he does say, I totally agree with. But this is what I want to talk about. Who came up with the whole pick me thing? From women labeling other women. Women who claim to love other women have now started, well not now, but I say now because it's new to me. They're now calling other women pick me's women who don't agree with their narrative women who don't agree with what they're saying now all of a sudden they're called pick me's i just don't understand that i actually don't understand that why can't i just have a difference of opinion and i don't get it like so we have to be in agreement with you and your group of people as soon as we disagree as soon as i disagree i'm a pick me let me tell you something i was speaking one time on a clubhouse on on the clubhouse app and i was talking about you know women holding each other accountable when i say things like that no way shape or form am i taking responsibilities away from men that is not what i'm doing men do need to be held accountable what i've noticed what i've seen in my group of friends in my generation women don't hold each other accountable i've had friends who were doing rubbish when i say rubbish i mean rubbish friends were doing rubbish ex-friend whatever i'm not saying that i'm perfect to advise them but surely when you see your friend messing up surely as a friend you should be able to come and tell them like no what you're doing mm. i never did that that's not a good friend that is not a good friend so i know for sure that i definitely could have held some of my friends accountable just like i expect them to hold me accountable to some of my behavior and some of my mess if i do something of course hold me accountable why not it's a two-way street because guess what we're not perfect you know it looks cute right ah! yes. yes 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 this head everything i did a good job I'm fucking say same as Need to get like some tiger prawns from here. I can't seem to find any of. <sighs> Got my prawns. I'm gonna go off and make my salad. Oh, hey my people um yeah so i'm gonna go and get my nails done because look how your girl's been walking around unacceptable i should not be walking around like that i should not be walking around like this okay do you see that i mean do you see that do do you see that i know the camera don't want you to see that but do you see that do you see that okay and do you see this okay so your girl needs to come correct rewind and come again go 
ahead and get my nails did because it's been a long time coming and I'm just tired of just walking around with like ghetto wretched nails. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I've been dealing with a lot in my own personal life so I've just thought maybe I should just come and share with you guys. We really have to be wary of um, the people that we allow to come into our lives and affect our energy. We really need to bear that in mind because we have to remember this, we are also responsible for what we allow to happen to us, okay? We really have to pay attention to the energy that we are allowing to soak in our spirits, like in our souls, cut it out, cut it out, cut it out. Anyway, let me go and get my nails done because my nails are ghetto, like I said. I'm gonna go ahead and get my nails done and I'll catch you guys in a little while. Hey, what's up guys? Um, I look a whole mess. Let me see. How do I look now? How do I look now? Huh? How do I look now? How do I look now? How do I look now? Anyways, I've just got in not long ago. I need to make dinner. So I want you guys to stick around and make dinner with me. Oh yeah, I did my nails. Do you guys like my nails now? Ooh, yes! Oh my god. Yes, there she is. There she is, there she is. I literally do the same nails each and every time. I'm one of those people, so when I find something that I like, I stick to it, because what's the point? What's the point of changing? What's the point of changing? It's like I go Subway, Nazwaka, the same thing as Subway. Italian, BMT, toasted, no cheese, lettuce, green onions, jalapenos, honey mustard, hot chili sauce. <laughs> yeah. I get the same meal each and every time, yeah. And it's so funny because when I go in there, I'm like, um... Let me have, um, Italian BMT, six-inch hot Italian bread toasted, no cheese, please. And I've received my package today, so I've been trying to order from HelloFresh. So this company is absolutely amazing because it's a little bit exactly. They send you food, right? So they send you food, including recipes just here. And a lot of these meals are really healthy. It includes like your five a day. It includes vegetables. So really, 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 really healthy. And sometimes I don't really have like the time um especially now that i'm trying to eat right so yeah so i'm absolutely trying to eat right it's definitely been helping me with just eating healthy food like just eating healthy and just keeping um an eye on my calories oh thank you oh that's so sweet i just got a really nice um youtube message just here oh that's so sweet thank you Mmm, thanks. Um, yeah, so anyways, if you guys don't mind, I don't know what why did I come to sit back down? Lazy. Anyways, yeah, so what I'm gonna do is I think I'm gonna go for this one. This meal only takes 15 minutes to prepare, okay? So let me see. What should I eat today? What should I eat today? So this one is the super fast Asian style pork noodles. There's the teriyaki sesame chicken. Look at that. It even shows you the picture, how it looks like at the end. It includes, it basically includes all of the ingredients in here. Instructions. And yeah, so yeah, I'm going to do the noodles today. Is that how you say it? Asian or say? Anyways, we're going to the um, Asian persuasion today. Number 13, just there. Number 13, just there. So this is what we're gonna cook, so let's do it. said to um, cook the noodles which we put up Zungu on the motopona it took a maip and a tuchan noodles. So we're boiling the water right now to dash the noodles in. The next one it says brown the pork. Heat a splash of oil in a large frying pan over high heat. Add the pork, sprinkle in the Thai spice. Cook that between five to six minutes until it's brown. Easy. Okay, so the other package comes at this, and this basically has all the frozen stuff or the fresh stuff that needs to be kept in the fridge um and it comes with like ice packs as you can see so that your food like won't go off or anything like that our pork mince uh what else do we need from here look it also comes with pudding too right <laughs> for the pudding 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 all along okay let's cook <laughs> <laughs> 
my love as well, do you know what I mean? Just because I'm wearing wigs doesn't mean that I'm going to keep my hair dusty underneath it, you know? Do you know what I'm saying? So it said 15 minutes to cook. So I'm literally going to put a timer to see if it really does take 15 minutes to prepare this meal. Okay. Go. Ew. I don't think I've had pork mince before, you know. This is my first time. Uh, while the pork is cooking, half the pepper, remove the core. How do you remove the core seeds? <gasps> yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, so it's said to cook the pasta for four minutes, which I believe I have done. Next, it says to add the Thai spice blend just there, which I will, okay. Add the green pepper to the pork, cook for three to four minutes. Let's do it. All your splatter god amazing next up it says to mix the ketchup ketchup what's the ketchup ketchup it says mix the ketchup um with the rice vinegar and the honey together in the bowl and squeeze the lime juice in it okay so we're gonna mix the ketchup that looks like tar oh my goodness rice vinegar I should have rolled my lime first just to get the juices going. Oh, why didn't I roll it? It's so hard to squeeze. You guys have seen me doled up. You guys have seen me. Anyways, let's uh, mix the juices together. I'll oh, give it a go. Delicious. Some spring onions in there. This is not included in the recipe, but I just have to add it in there. Like, there's no flavor. Eh, pardon. A little bit of flavor, okay? Just a little bit. Eh, pardon, yes, we. We're gonna leave that for about, how long does it say? Two minutes. All right, let me wash the dishes. Yes, diamond. Coriander over it nicely and. Father God, I bless you, I glorify you. Please bless this food that I am about to enjoy, Father. Oh, remove Kinduki, Sanya, remove Kinduki, Sanya, please. Allow me to enjoy. In Jesus' name, amen. Because I'm I'm super proud of this, so. Mm. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Anyway, guys, I'm going to love and leave you guys here. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog style. If you want to see more of these types of like day-to-day -day life cooking please comment down below and let your sister know that you enjoyed it so i can give you guys some more thank you guys so much for watching i'm going to enjoy the rest of my meal and i love and appreciate you guys all very so much and i will catch you guys on my next vlog bye mm.